Hi, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Lauren and this is Cosplay Girl Budgets. And today we are doing my second paycheck of March to finish off the month. And yay, I'm so excited to be cash stuffing. It kind of feels like forever since I've done my last paycheck. Cash kind of cash stuffing, regular expenses and stuff like that. So let's get into it. So first off, I'm going to be really transparent. <laughs> I definitely did a lot of emotional spending and so it kind of reflects that in my budget normally i would be cash staffing a lot more but yeah i just overspent a lot and i took it out of my paycheck so we're all squared away but that's that's why it's a little less than usual all right so i'm not going to count it but i will tell you that it is five hundred and ninety six dollars that were cash stuffing today so the thing that suffered was definitely savings challenges but you know it is what it is and honestly the reason why I was doing a lot of extra spending is because I've just been very um, anxious lately and it's definitely a habit I'm trying to correct because uh, I don't want to be overspending a lot. Like, I want to be able to reach some of my goals this year. Um, not that I regret any of the purchases that I made because I love everything that I purchased. So, $20 in prop is, you'll see where that goes later, but that's what we have for prop money today. So, yeah, I've just been a little bit anxious lately because I have two months to move and a lot of other little things have been um, going on with my, like, you know, with the past, with my car and stuff. So the past two weeks, I've just been kind of like spending on the things that I, that bring me joy. So, um, that is the spiel. So let's get into my wallet first off and see what we have left in cash envelopes. You probably can guess, but we don't really have anything. So we're going to stuff that. Alrighty, so everything that I use in my videos are listed down below if you'd um, like anything. And if you can't find it, let me know. For Create today, we're going to be putting $20 and it is empty. I uh, decided to cut back on spending. Um, which I probably shouldn't have done since I do have two events coming up um, on the weekend. But I've been so doing so much spending that that's why I kind of cut myself back. But we'll see how this weekend goes. And dining out is going to get its usual 20. And that is it for dining out. Personal is going to get ah, 15, and we're going to do that in fives. One, uh, five, ten, fifteen. So by the time you'll see this, the weekend will have passed because I usually upload Tuesdays and Thursdays. But I am going to my karaoke and brunch with my friends. And then I'm going to an aquarium with my family. So that's why I'm like, maybe I should have budgeted myself a little bit more for my spending. So for our challenge, which is basically me putting aside money for, or the ones that I spend out of my cash envelopes. And today we have one, two, three, four, five dollars. And you'll see where I put that. So that's it for my cash envelopes. And we can put that in, back in here. Okay, so that's it for my wallet. So before we go on, if you can see this on the side, this is all like my little happy mail. I usually order all of my budget stickers from Carla May, and so I ordered my April kit, and she was having a anniversary sale this past, I think, a week or two ago, and so I bought a bunch of her buttons. She does a lot of artwork, and I bought a lot of her Sailor Moon buttons. So this is Sailor Saturn. This is Sailor 
Chibi Moon. This is Jupiter. They're just so cute. We have Mars and Pluto. So cute. And then she also did um, artwork inspired by No Face from Studio Ghibli. And it's shiny and it's basically her No Face girl. I got this sticker and then I also got her print. But it's hanging on my wall at the moment so I can't really show you. And then she had two freebies. These were her like freebies if you ordered a certain amount. And then I also ordered a pin, which is a black magical bow. I love it so much. I can't wait to get this wallet that I can put all my pins in. If you watch my anime con vlog, you know what I'm talking about. And yes, that is part of the splurge that I did. But I, that's why I said I have no regrets. <laughs> so I'm going to put this to the side and we'll continue with our cash stuffing. Okay, so let's start with our high priority binder and if you saw my short you know I have these cute little uh, new envelopes from Baking Budgets and this is a cute little dashboard that she sent me for free as a freebie so groceries is going to get $80 today so 20 40 60 80 I do it like well, we'll see. 20, 40, 60, 80 in groceries. I've been enjoying every plate, but I'm going to probably stop it because um, now that I have a car payment, I need to like cut back on like unnecessary things. And like every plate is about $60 a week, so that comes out to be a lot. Um, and when I normally budget myself $80, so. I have been like taking like the second like some of the money out of my paychecks so I think I'm gonna stop it as much as I like it maybe I'll do it like every once in a while but yeah I'm gonna cancel it so gas is going to get $60 uh, I think I'll do 50 60 so 55 was a little too short, so I'm going to do 60. I'm kind of playing around with my new car because I'm not sure how much gas money I need for it. So Enzo has $2, and we'll add that to our dollar challenge. And he's going to get 25 today. And then we are skipping vet because that's fully funded. And I just wanted to show you guys this was one of the purchases that I made. It's a check that you can write in and it's by the Budgeting Dolls and it's Sailor Moon themed. So I've decided I'm going to use these when I uh, have basically fully funded my envelope. So we have $400 for our vet expenses. And he has a vet appointment coming up soon in April. So I'm very happy that that's all done. So Pet Emergency is going to get $10 today. So now it has 120, 30, 40, and we're going to color in our pet savings. Well, I guess I should say right. <laughs> so $10 into our pet savings, and this is by 40 Plus Life. Okay, next up is health, and health is going to receive $10. Basically, I tried to put $10 in um, all of these envelopes except for Enzo because his dog food is so expensive. So we have 10 and 20 in health. And I'm thinking about taking a warm yoga class. Um, it's been a long time and I really need, with the job that I have, I'm constantly on my feet and walking around. So I want to be um, flexible so that I don't get any injuries. Tan is going to get $10 today. We are still working on the $25 that we scratched off on Amethyst Budget Scratch and Save. So now we're putting in $10, and I just owe $10 more for that. So we have $10, or $20, $35, $40 dollars for Tom. And Tom's my boyfriend. And this is basically for date night and um, birthday. Family is going to get $10. 
And I think I'm going to put this down and let's see, 20, 45, and I'm putting 10, so that's going to be 50. So I'm going to put down these two 20s and grab this 50. So now we have 55 in family. And definitely going to be using this at the aquarium. So I'm super excited. I haven't been to an aquarium in so long. Car maintenance is going to receive $10. And I used what I have here because um, I need to do wipers. So hopefully that'll be the extent of my car maintenance for a while. Holidays is going to get a 10. But uh, I guess I'll do that in two fives. As I ran out of 10s. Let's see. Here's another 10. So now in our Easter savings, we have 25, 30, and this is by Simple Shops over on her Etsy. All right, so P.O. Box is going to get $5 like usual, and now it has 25, 35, 45, which is great. We're almost there, and my payment's almost coming up. Business is going to get skipped taxes as well and that's it for my pink binder. Next up is my purple long-term savings binder and we are going to be putting 20 no fifty dollars in month ahead. I kind of mentioned in my last video that a lot of things have changed in my binders and it did, a lot did change in here. I did kind of rearrange stuff and I am highly focused back on month ahead because now with moving in two months, um, I'm moving back in with my mom, thankfully, so that means I don't need a security deposit, so that's good. But um, then I'm going to be moving in with my boyfriend eventually when he graduates, so I need to have some money for that. So now we have 50, 100, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. So awesome. 35. Um, I think I'm gonna, let's see. I'm gonna move this down. I'll take the 10 and two fives and I'll put a 20 in here. Okay. Just to make some change. And that's it for month ahead. My 52 weeks is going to get 27 today. We're going to do two more. We're going to do number 13 and 14. And at the moment, I am about a week ahead of the 52 week, but I kind of, with my car stuff, I kind of didn't wasn't able to stuff this more so I'm kind of thankful that I was a little bit ahead so I don't fall behind alrighty so now month ahead has 50, 20, <laughs> 50, 70, 90, 5, 100 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So $115, yay! So I will definitely be doing a couple $100 deposits because you know I like to deposit $100 in my bank account every time it reaches in my envelopes. So I definitely will be doing it for these two. And then emergency is gonna get the prop 20. And now emergency has 20, 40, 60 and $70 in the bank. So I'm just going to bring this out here. This is the 20 bi-weekly savings challenge from budgeting just because. And we're going to color in another jar. All right. So that's that. All right, so for this one, my 2023 and 2023 is going to get 64. 
I'm trying to complete like this row so I can feel accomplished. <laughs> So 50, 60, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57. So 257, yay! Another 100, and that will go back to the bank. So that's it for this one. Move Out is going to get um, $10. I just want to give this a little bit of love, um, just because I don't really know how much my Move Out expenses is going to be. So we have 1,000 in the bank, five and 10. So 1,010. And then savings, which is my Vegas challenge, and that's going to get a 50 today. So let me color this in. Okay, and then this one is by Janelle Ray Budgets, and I just need to start this because I have a trip coming up in October, and I haven't even started saving, and Vegas is expensive, so let's do this. Alrighty, so that's it for my Vegas challenge, and then Christmas is getting 25, and... So now in Christmas we have 100, 50, 70, 90, and 95. Awesome. Almost 200. And we are going to finally get to scratch off another one. Yay! So let's see. Let's scratch off. Let's scratch off this one. Okay. So we are going to do 35 next time around and then I took out Halloween um, just for now because it's not really a main focus and I don't want to be sad not stuffing it. <laughs> Loans is going to get five dollars today. Oh I totally skipped my 1k challenge. That's getting stuffed today. Let me go back. All right. So my pink marker is missing in action, but I guess I'll use orange today. It's going to get $20. So now it has 100, 200, 300 already paid to my credit card and then 320. So this 1K savings challenge, if you're new here, is going towards my debt. And there we go, that's it. And then loans is going to get five, like normal. So now we have 55, 60. And this is for my student loans when they come back. And then car is gonna be getting skipped. So that's it for my long-term sinking funds. Alrighty, next up is my fun binder. I do get to stuff this a little bit. Let me put these here. So I decided that I want to at least stuff this one with one dollar for like each envelope at least if I can't do more. So Wonderlust is going to get a dollar and I actually still have my five lay from Romania. So I'm just going to keep that in there. So $1 in Wonderless and 5 play. <laughs> BFFs is going to get $11 because hopefully this will help with my expenses when I 
go down to the city. So now in BFFs, we have 20, 35, 45, 47, 49, 50, 51. So I don't know if that's going to be enough, but at least it'll soften the blow for my next paycheck. Coffee is going to get a dollar as well, and that's what it has. Sushi is getting a dollar, which is like sushi, which is like sushi dates for me, because I love sushi. And then hobbies is going to get a dollar, and it has one, two, three, four. And this is, could be for anything like cosplay and stationary things. Tattoo is going to get a dollar. I'm going to a tattoo convention and I feel like I might get a tattoo and if I do that's definitely coming out of my paycheck. Wardrobe is going to get a dollar. Home is getting a dollar. Electronics is getting a dollar. <laughs> Such a theme. And then now my envelope, which is has the birthday savings challenge in here by Hawaii Mom Budgets. That's gonna get ten dollars today. Alrighty, so now we have 10, 15, and 20. And I haven't decided what I'm gonna do with that money. I kinda wanna go on like a like a solo trip. But I haven't decided. I don't really know how much this is, so I guess we'll see in the end if I can do a solo trip with it. Birthdays is gonna get five dollars, and we're working on Tom because I already have mine in my envelope, so I'm just gonna do, put his. So we have, let's get my calculator. We have 25 in my brother, five in my boyfriend's, and 28 in my nephew's, which is $58 in birthdays. And then giveaways is getting $1. Starting this back up again. We're almost close to 600, which is, very awesome so thank you guys for subscribing and wanting to join my journey i know this is like probably late in the video and maybe people have left by now but if you're still here thank you for being a real one and sticking through my whole video and watching me i really appreciate it and then giving is also getting one dollar too so that's it for my fun binder getting into my sailor moon scratch off i did budget i think this should be an eight because it's 70 altogether and I had to put it towards my car, but I do want to finish this challenge. So I had one more to scratch off and so I'm going to scratch off one, this last one. So yay, it is $8. So I have officially finished my first Sailor Moon scratch off, the Saturn one, the Guardian of Rebirth. And if you like these challenges, I sell them on my Etsy shop. It's linked down below. So yay, we, get to, we got one down. So I'm gonna put $8. Five, six, seven, eight. So Yay! I don't know what I'm going to put this $8 to, but we shall see in an upcoming video. So the next one is going to be Guardian of the Deep Blue Sea, which is Sailor y Neptune. <laughs> I almost said Uranus, but it's Sailor Neptune. So super excited about that. I am going to be doing a little bit of a sale on my Etsy shop, but uh, keep an eye out. I will announce that on my Instagram and also in my community tab when it will be live. Alrighty, so let's see how much money we have. We have five and six. We have six dollars left. Alright, so we're going to go into our dollar challenge and take out this chunky money <laughs> and we're going to add 
one, two, three, four, five, six, seven dollars into our challenge, which is awesome. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's see how much we have. I might switch this out um, soon because it's getting a little thick. So now in our $1 savings challenge, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30, 31, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 40, 41, 2, 3, 4. That can't be right. I think I messed up. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. It should be 50, 54. Oh my gosh. I'll recount it and I'll just speed it up. <laughs> Okay, yes, 54. So I'm definitely gonna switch this out for a $50 bill because, yeah, that's a lot of ones. It is thick. So I have just made the decision now to pause my $5 challenge. I think it just takes me a very long time to do it. So, and I like, I can't just have this money sitting here like I really need to allocate it to things where like this goes really quickly like I only started this in January and I'm already halfway through so I think I can definitely finish this like halfway at least halfway through the year or maybe sooner um, so I'm definitely going to continue with the $1 challenge but I'm going to retire the $5 challenge for now which is kind of sad but that gives us an extra $5 to play with so we have $11 here and I want to, let's see, am I missing anything? Yes, I am. Oh my gosh. All right. Before I jump into any more savings challenges, I need to finish my quarterly savings challenge because it's the last time I'm stuffing it and we get to figure out um, how much we put in here. So we're on weeks four and five and... I'm sorry, Mel. I've <laughs> not been filling out this tracker. I'm going to be so much better with it in the second quarter, I swear. But we are going to add $6 in here today because when I budgeted each week, it would, came out to $3. So now we have $6 going in here. And I can't wait to count this. I'm going to be doing a quarterly update video very, very soon. So that'll probably be, I know, honestly, that'll probably be my next video, just to wrap up March. So that's it for that. Yay. Okay, so that leaves us with $5. What do I want to do with $5? Um, I want to do one of my other savings challenges. I'm going to be doing a lot of savings over from Loch Ness, say, from Loch Nessie budgeting. And this one equals 25. I want to do a lot of like smaller challenges and then <laughs> eventually get back into my other challenges, but we're going to start off slow. So, and then I also received um, some happy mail from Cute Budgets. She sent me her tarot card savings challenge so I'm going to be using that in my savings challenges as well um, I don't want to do this one because I could possibly pull a um, major like a knight or a queen or a king and that equals 20 so I don't want to chance that so I'm going to start that a next cash stuffing so this $5, where should I put it? I think I'm just going to put it into my monthly challenges. No. <laughs> I can't decide. 
Oh, I feel like, you know what? Yes, I'm going to put it in my monthly challenges. We're just going to do that because I'm slacking on that. Um, I already completed this for this month, but I like to stuff like little extras in here and um, hopefully at the end of the year I'll have like a little extra money to do with whatever with. So we have 5, 10, oh my gosh, 5, 10, 11. Um, I haven't quite decided if I'm going to like unstuff it at the end of the year or also do this quarterly. Hmm, I'm not sure because I do kind of want to use like put money towards like everything like all my dollars towards my goals but um I haven't decided yet yeah th at this point I'm sorry I'm reveling <laughs> so that is the end of this cash stuffing video I have no more money and if you made it to the end of this video please put a moon emoji because I have so much Sailor Moon stuff going on over here and thank you for watching this video and I will see you in my next one which will hopefully be a quarterly update. Until then, have a wonderful day and I'll see you next time. Bye!